लिफ्ट हिम क्विक क्विक सेव्ड हिम थैंक यू थैंक यू गॉड हैज सेव्ड मी फ्रॉम माय प्राइड टू आई वाज गोइंग टू सेन मार्टिन चर्च फॉर अ बाइबल डिस्कोर्स मोर देन द लॉर्ड्स माइट I tried to expose my knowledge. I was punished by him. It's a lesson for me. Were you in a hurry, father? Ha. Huh. Yes. That's why I rode so fast. No more of that again. I thank you for. Please don't thank us, father. Actually, it's we who should thank you. We have only showed our gratitude. Thank Lord. Why gratitude? Mm hmm. Yes, Father. He too met with an accident in Becky. Thanks to the Almighty, a kind family then took him to their house, treated him, and saved him. A deacon's family, and the mother. Oh, when I gained consciousness, I saw her face, like Mother Mary who carries infant Jesus. in her hands who rescued when in trouble uh bosco is their family name <laughs> i am also from there do you know <gasps> my name is john bosco some scoundrels every day hey move 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 only five boys mm -hmm. come on no, take no, them no, for the job don't kick my face I told you no 
we'll get it. understand your mind. I too tried to gather these boys for their benefit in the past. Hmm. They won't permit. They won't allow anybody to do anything for the boys. Even if nobody permits, I will do. Anyhow, I'll be with you. Praise the Lord, Father. Praise the Lord. No work in the factory, no money in the pocket. Ah, I can't bear this hunger. Children, if you are hungry, I will feed you. The saint has come to feed us. We are not beggars. I didn't say so. I just invited you all to dine with me, my boys. We are not coming with you. You don't like yourselves and the society that made you so. What will you say? We are not coming. Come on, guys. Let's go, man. You will come. I know one day you will come. <laughs> By ringing this bell, my hand is only paining. Nobody seems to come to the church. Oh, my Lord. No one in this whole world seems to think they have committed any sin. What a relief! One person at least has come. Boy, sit that side. Your mass is going to begin. To serve mass? I don't want to serve. Then why did you come to church? It's cold. It's too cold. That's why. Bad fellow. <laughs> church is only the place you found. Get lost. Hmm. <laughs> I am not going to stay here, you monkey of a man. What did you say? You monkey of a man! You <laughs> monkey? You stop there! You stop there! I will teach you! I will teach you lesson! Give it! Give it! Leave it! Mm. Leave it! Hey, stop it! What happened? Father, he was sitting in the church for taking shelter from the cold. When I told this boy to go out, he called me monkey. Just leave it. What's your name? Bartholomew Garelli. Hmm. Come, come with me. Huh? Hey, come, don't fear. You monkey! <laughs> <laughs> come on. I won't leave you next time. I'm giving, I'm giving two rupees. Hey, 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 hey,
What's the matter? Father snatched away our money. Money is being snatched away. Is it to father? <laughs> In that cloth, it's our money. In this? Hmm? Take it, take it. Hmm. Uh, um, uh. There is nothing inside. Father stole our money. What father has stolen from you is not your money, but your hearts. Then where is the money? It is with you only. Check it. I can't find it. Uh huh. Not there. Mm. Here. Mm. Wow. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Come on, have it. <laughs> <laughs> hey. <laughs> hey, why are you guys here? We are come to study. You have also come to study. Nice. Study what? Snatching money? Mm -hmm. No. To learn to live and stand on your own legs without stealing. Is it right, father? Uh, no. Where could we find a place for these boys? For the time being, we will teach them in this church. But the children need a place for recreation. Ah, our Lord will show a way for them. You proceed. Thanks. Come, come on, come on, boys. Ah, uh, what's your name? Johnny. Uh huh. Nice name, little Johnny. <laughs> Shall we join them? It's all a humbug, man. It's a trick to teach religion. I don't think he's a fake. He told about playing also. I think he is out of his mind. Anyway, let's go and see. We have nothing else to do. If it is all a fake, we will come back. Yeah. yeah. yeah come on, come on, man. Come on, move. Excuse me, don't go away. I came to confess, not to preach. I know I can't do it. It's too noisy here. I'm going. Pardon me. Just wait. Just wait, please. Is this how you run an orphanage? Oh, this is not an orphanage. This is an oratory. That's what Father Bosco says. Oratory? You're right. 
This is a place for children for vocational training and games. Before vocational training, I asked that father to teach them discipline. Hmm. Mm. Alberto. Hey, 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 Shall I go then? I'll teach you all a lesson. I can't make my confession. I'll go and complain. What a nuisance. The boys and the father. Playing with the boys, taking them everywhere, this father has cheap taste. Ah, other fathers like us are also ashamed of him. Nobody is coming to the church nowadays. How will they come? The hobby of the boys is to chase those who come for confession. But matured people like Father Kafaso should not allow these things to happen, I say. I understand. I had helped that father in many of his attempts which I admit. If the Lord permits, it should be so, I think. You all know that there was a time where apostles and even mere Christians were mercilessly slaughtered. Congregation faced those challenges, sacrificed many a life and progressed to this stage. But we fail to think of the Good Shepherd who searches for those wavered ones. In Don Bosco, it's that Good Shepherd I find. It's time for me to go. Father himself will tell you the rest. Hmm? <laughs> they are orphans. Aren't they poor street children? It's my duty to lead them along the right path. That's my only goal. It's a mission given to me by the Almighty. And I have faith He will help me reach it. Hmm. One thing, whatever the circumstance, I will be with them till my end and I will never let them stray. Hmm. Must be more than thousands of children on the streets, isn't it? What can He do about them? How can you fit all of them in such a little church? <laughs> With the help of Mother Mary, everything is done. Huh? The place where we can wholly accommodate all the boys who come. With workshops, laboratories and all facilities. Surprise? Not only that, a large playground for the children. A very large church with priests, brothers, professors, all are there. <laughs> Where on earth is this wonderful ority, Father? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not aware. But one thing, everything is ready to start. Huh? Uh. God bless. If we treat him now, he will be better. But who will send him to hospital? Hmm? Hmm? If by some trick, somebody can take him there, I'll do the rest. Let Father Thomas and Matthew huh? attempt. They can use some force also if needed. Should we do that, Father? Oh, somebody should do it, no? As Father Kafaso mentioned, it's like the good shepherd searching for the lost lambs. Hmm. Oh. Dig deep. It's the limit, Father. This is all rock. No, you sit here. Remember what I told you? Once he gets inside and closes the door, you rush. 
there might be some noise. Huh? He will ask you to stop the vehicle. But unless you reach the mental hospital, don't stop. If you stop midway, we will settle you. Okay? Mm. Be sir there. Be careful father. <laughs> you two friends. This is too much. Can we approach? It's better to run away. He's armed. See his weapon. But we have agreed, you know. Huh? I don't think it's safe. Our lives are in danger. <laughs> Shall we run? Mm. Mm. Shall we run? I am shivering with fear. My God. Mm. Mm. Huh? Uh, uh, Father, hello, she has told us. Uh. It's not to the mental hospital. Just, uh -huh. just for a chat, isn't uh. it? Uh. 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 I see. Uh. Let's go. Uh. Uh. Let's go. Uh. Mm. Uh. Uh. I mentioned once, they won't allow. They won't allow anything good to be done. <laughs> they say these boys destroy that peace. We'll have to make it. Shall we keep the small ones here and send the big ones away? Where to? Again to the streets? No, can't. If not this place, somewhere else. But I am not going to send them back to the streets. These boys, I need them. A good shepherd cannot send his lambs away, father. Because of us, Father, we know that. So what? They tried their best to chase us away. Still we grew in strength. A cabbage. When transplanted, it grows. But where shall we go, Father? <laughs> Don't worry. Our God will show the way. Now it will be nuisance here too. It's very great. Eh? <laughs> uh, huh? 
Who asked you to come here? God. <laughs> Nobody is there to question God, no. We will tell Father Borel. He is the in charge, no? Come. La 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 la. Father, I lost. I lost my rhythm. You will. You will lose your rhythm. Those children and their father will destroy this church too. Oh, I don't think so. Yeah, that's why they have been chased out from everywhere. Bishop permitted. I too thought it was a nice idea. Yes, you will think so. But we are the ones who suffer. Oh, I don't bother about that. But it's not the bishop who rules the country. I know that. But then why should all of you come here? Go there. Yes, that's where we are going. Come on. He's ha! no good. La 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 la. Uh huh. You all have come. We like to live peacefully, but we can't even pray quietly these days. Oh, you mean Don Bosco and the boys? Complaints are plenty. I'll take action. Marcus, don't repeat your government officials' ready-made answers to us. Because of this, Father Don Bosco, we don't get boys to work in our factory. That's right. There is a group of youth who listen to whatever he says. I tell you, they are vagabonds and criminals. This is dangerous. This father can stir up a revolution here. Mm. Look, there is nothing to be scared of. Who knows if this orator doesn't have such an intention? Ah, ah. Right. Tell me, what should I do now? Their entry into public places like church, with the bishop's permission or not, should be disallowed. If the government has granted permission, it should also be withdrawn. I am sorry to say, father, we quit this place. But you only gave us the consent to stay here. That's right. I gave you permission, but the public keeps on complaining about you and your oratory. We took lot of efforts and pains to save these boys from the streets. If I let them go away, they will go back to the streets again. There are a number of orphanages and boarding houses. Why don't you send them there? I don't want these children to be called orphans. They are not born on streets, though they too have parents who have no time for them. They don't need sympathy. All they need is caring, affection, and love. If we ignore them, half of our prisons will be occupied by these kind. If we fail in this God-given duty, this might happen. Mark my words, my friend. All those who make a hue and cry. May be happy now, but not forever. <laughs> Impediment to the growth of these innocent children now will destroy the society and humanity. Don't forget, crime is like an epidemic; it spreads like fire. Those who are doing this for their own selfishness can be happy now. Without realizing that they too will be consumed by it. So it's true. You can raise even a revolution, as the public say. <laughs> yes, it's a revolution that I need. But this revolution is non-violent, temperance, a bloodless revolt with love and peace. We are all following the footsteps paved by the Son of God, who took up all the pains and sins of the human race. Hmm. I may not be in a position to change your decision, but if you give me some more time, I'll be really grateful to you. I am sorry, my hands are tied. How are you, Father? Do you remember me, Pinadi? <laughs> Why not? How can I forget you? <laughs> I remember very well, brother. 
Any good news? Good news. I heard that you are searching for a place for a laboratory. <laughs> Not laboratory. Oratory. Oratory. Oh. Come. <laughs> Father, what's oratory? A place for the children for vocational training, games, etc. I am a poor farmer. For me, laboratory and oratory are the same. Ha! Huh, but there is a right place for that. Is it your own place? Yeah, almost like my own. My friends. When he went away, he asked me to sell it or rent it out for anybody. <laughs> I think it will suit you and your boys. I'll see the place tomorrow morning. You have approached me at the right time to show me the place. If the place suits me, I'll be very happy. See, that's the place. The same place Mother Mary showed me in my dream. Plant your vine. It will grow and spread its branches over the whole world. Build my church here. Won't it suit you? Enough. It's more than enough. <laughs> We have this small bell here to praise our God Almighty. Pray, the Lord will shower all His blessings upon us. He has given us this place so we can live together. Let's thank Him for that. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Thank you. Let's pray. Our Father who art in heaven, You have been coughing for some days now. See a doctor and take rest. Rest? No, no. I have so many more things to complete. Holy sons have shed their blood on the soil. I should build Mother Mary's church here. You mean church? Why not a church here? What about the money, Father? Mother Mary will give. Yeah. Hmm. Church. What about food? Church indeed. Pass, pass. Catch it, catch it. Hey, come on, come on, come on. 
Vamos, 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 Fever has increased. I think it is pneumonia. The work is too much, isn't it? Hmm. Come on, sir. Let us see you. Come on. Follow. Oh, no. 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 Nobody should go inside. Let him take rest. Okay. Has he planned for the future after his? Uh... No. Why do you ask me that? Uh, no, uh, his condition is very critical. That's why, father. Can we see him? Doesn't matter. Please go and sleep, my boys. No need. We'll wait here. Boys, where are they? Mm, You have been praying for me throughout the night. Oh, God has listened to your prayers. I will live for many more years as the Almighty has desired.
यू नीड मी आई नीड यू फॉर लॉन्ग लॉन्ग इयर्स थैंक्स फॉर योर प्रेयर्स How are you now? I feel better now. To be frank, this oratory needs a mother. We need to give them motherly care. Who will come here as a mother to share our poverty? Can't you call your mother? Who? My? My mother? Will she come if you call? Sure, she will come. <laughs> Huh? My puppy. Hey, don't give it. My puppy. <laughs> my puppy. Give my puppy. Don't touch it. Oh. <laughs> I think they are coming. रोजारियो बैंजियो हाउ डू यू नो ही हैड बीन डिस्क्राइबिंग यू बॉयज ऑन अ वे हियर मूव 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 डिड ही टेल अबाउट मी लेट जो यस लिटिल जॉनी Where is your puppy? Huh? 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 My 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 puppy. My puppy. Where's my puppy? My puppy. Ma. <laughs> Yours your puppy. Don't cry. <laughs> Only this? <laughs> Come. Thank you. deadly epidemic is going to spread here i can see heaps and heaps of dead bodies scattered all round nobody to bury them nobody at all jackals and dogs are tearing them some humans 
are asking for a drop of water. I'm afraid. My insights never go wrong. All the clothes are over, Father. Just go to Mama. She will give you one. I don't think there is a single piece of cloth left. Doesn't matter. If you ask Mama, she will give you something. Go, quick. Ah. Here, Father. Your wedding dress? Yes. I won't take this. Even if I had a hundred like this, I would have given all of them to the Lord. Take it there. Take it there. Hurry, boys! Go fast! Very urgent. Come on, go quick! Go fast, boys! Come on! Go fast! Very urgent. Go fast! Come on! Come on! Take this. Yes, serious case. Please come, Father. This puppy is nice. Can you give me? <laughs> Then you keep it. be kind and stop this catastrophe amen Praise the Lord now and forever. He is my son's favorite.
you have done a great service to humanity father otherwise it would have been worse every boy in the oratory knows it is jesus who comes to us with hunger and with diseases father can you take him to your oratory mm of course i find something good in him when cholera spread all over the town when worms ate human corpses on the streets where were you citizens of this town and industrial leaders to give them a little water to bury them only this father and his boys were there you only started taking action against them yes now i realize it was all wrong you misled me saying the father and the boys are up to the revolution here no i'm not accusing anybody but we have to approve of one thing this society needs them this movement with don bosco should flourish a small grant from a municipality should be given to the poor oratory of the father this is my decision today i need 10 boys hey! i need one who can come it's okay both can it's okay you can also come all of you come all of you <laughs> you boys hey where, where are you going i tell you there is job for all of you come back please i tell you come back you boys come back oh my. That's the way. Okay. No, this way. This way. Okay. So, we have a press now. You all should learn this properly. Understand? I have already learned. Mm -hmm. <laughs> In that case, my Savio, you have to teach everyone. Father, hmm? look here. the proof mm good job thanks <laughs> mm. the type how is it father the rent looks okay the name i said rent the name is so good we have to give this month rent what about last month's rent yes that's already given but this month that will be given ha ah. and that of the next month ha ah. and even for the succeeding months ah. Ah. who will give money for all this god <laughs> if not the full rent i hope you will give at least off <laughs> drink and be merry you guys look at this father is publishing a newspaper this will be circulating all the people will start believing him people will start supporting him in spite of all this they are claiming more and more facilities for the laborers they are claiming for more wages also you see yeah not only that he snatches away the boys who come that's a lie they choose to go with father boys ko isn't that the truth why shouldn't they go you are throwing tokens for jobs you should be more humane then you to go with the father what i said is true think about how to corner the father or else you will have to close the factory you understand <laughs> invest some money money what for <laughs> who will not fall for money that father is hard pressed for funds <coughs> the grant is nothing for him his debts are too much i know i know that in that case we would repay all his debts okay <laughs> <laughs> isn't it nice god didn't say create everybody rich <laughs> <laughs> if we decide we can help you father then you decide you have so many debts 
we'll repay them but on a condition you should never come to the factory you should also leave these children to us hmm? i cannot accept that leave why do you create problems my dear father these factory owners are very rich people they might do anything they like you are very careless in going out even at midnight if something happens to you i think you will be sorry for it hmm? how dare you you threaten me in my own office <laughs> Don't have to wait till midnight. Do it now. Uh, uh, don't get angry. Uh, we were just mentioning it, uh, isn't it? Uh. Mm. I know about you all and your character. I had always known what you had come here for. But I am a father, so I control my emotions. If I'm not a father, I too can speak your language. Since I wear this I hold back myself. Garelli, Antonio, come here. Hmm. These two have lost their way. You can show them the way out. Father hasn't come yet. No, dear, not yet. Oh. Where were you all this time? There was a miracle on the way. How is he now? Is he better? Tell me, what happened? What happened? On my way back, I was attacked by an unknown man. But then, all of a sudden. A big dog suddenly appeared uh, and nearly tore off the arm. My son, <laughs> he was bitten. When I called the dog with full affection, it obeyed my command. Uh, Here it is. He must have dreamt about it. A living dog coming and lying down on his bed. Liar! <laughs> If it is so, you would have seen the dog. Uh -huh. No, it came after we slept. Yeah, after sleep only dream comes. <laughs> no, no, it's true. Hello, boys. What's the matter? Yesterday night, a dog came to his side. Then the dog slept beside him. I think he's mad. <laughs> he's going crazy. <laughs> he 
It's true, father. Hmm. A big dog, you know, came near me and lay lovingly. It's true. I believe. I wanted to spend my last days here. Don't say so. God is always with you to save you. Just go home, take rest, get well, and come back happily. Isn't it? Hmm. I had told him the same thing. Come on, let's go. No, I won't be coming back. A grape wine that was planted in a little soil is our oratory. In the rain, in the wind, we all took great care of it. In the bright sun, we gave it a shade. Mother Mary's kind blessings has helped it grow. Now this should spread all over the world. that alone is my dream but i can't do any of these alone if you all be with me i can fulfill all these dreams not one of my dreams has perished so far by the grace of holy mother This congregation will be known as the Salesian Congregation. Our patron for this society will be Saint Francis de Sales, who is a model of kindness. All I ask you is a life of dedication and devotion. but in return i can offer you only poverty of this world It's all 
for you and your salations. I feel it's time for my departure. When I close my eyes, I hear the angels flutter their wings. Before God calls me, I wanted to talk to you personally. That's why I called you here. My humble advice, try to go hand in hand with the Archbishop. I have been hand in hand all the while. Things have changed now completely. People have created much of misunderstanding. All that should be sorted out. <laughs> Give Caesar what is Caesar's. But now, Caesar comes to us in the form of Almighty. Mm. <laughs> I am going there tomorrow. This must be the reason then. Mother Mary will help you. Ah, Don Bosco. Your unlawful forming of congregation creates problems for all. What is the problem in this? Father, you know, as the written laws and the discipline that has been followed for years which keeps the church together. Because of your new congregation, it is this strength that is weakened. I have to interfere in whatever that harms the root of our church. I have the authority to do so, isn't it? Yes, you have. That's why I came here as soon as you asked me to come. Truly, Salatians are not against anybody. It is just a relief from those who suffer from poverty and grief. That's all we do. Right. But after your time? Guards may come and go. That doesn't mean the palace is insecure. When one leaves, another comes. I may be a god only for now. But in future, Lord himself will appoint the next one. Why not do this under the existing laws of church? It's very much possible, Bosco, isn't so? All my dreams have gone beyond all this. Street children and orphans are abundant in this land. I do feel they need utmost help. I am doing that. And fortunately, no help was offered. Even now the church wants them in its jurisdiction not because of love or kindness. To be frank, the church fears about its own stability. I beg your excuse if I speak beyond my limits. The church's foundation should not be based on laws. It should be based on faith, love and kindness. <laughs> hmm. Bosco, I thought I could convince you. But unfortunately, you took me to a decision which personally I dislike. From today you won't have any rights to listen to confession or to do anything with the children. I beg you sincerely, kindly reconsider this. Through confession only, I really understand all their troubles and guide them. Mm -hmm. Take it easy. For those children, in the name of God, I shall appoint someone. That means? In villages too, we do need priests. What shall we do now, Father? 
we have no one to help us for those who are helpless there is god's help we think we have done all these but truly it is the lord who does everything i am going to write to the pope about this he is the representative of god i am sure he will understand us I was a farmer boy full of dreams in my dreams wild animals turned to calm sheep at that time i was only 9 a lady appeared in front of a starry divinely celestial light and told me transform my children like what happened to the animals at that age without understanding all this i wept she kept her arm on my head and told me in a pacifying tone that you will understand everything in due time I was urged to serve the poor and needy street children and be a solace to them and that's what I'm trying to do in my humble life. <laughs> 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 Mr Alberto I congratulate you <laughs> you are in a good form today we have cleared don bosco from our town i had two pegs for that <laughs> only two pegs two pegs for you two two drinks for the poor father two plus two means already five no i want two more drinks two two for whom is that that's for the pope a letter for approval is being dispatched to rome just to celebrate that <laughs> yeah letter indeed he failed here what is he going to earn from rome go man my friend nothing will happen our archbishop has such an influence in vatican you know what is that of the four cardinals two are in our pockets <laughs> Your Don Bosco will be transferred to a rural ditch <laughs> for the rest of his life. That means <laughs> that means the chapter of Don Bosco is closed. Come with your father. <laughs> Where to? This is your home. If you go from here, all the efforts will go waste. We don't want this. If you're not here, I'm your father. You should listen to this. This is your home. You should not leave. Whatever I did for your sake, that you should do for needy people.
wherever i am my children smiling faces i should have in mind i am always with you smile smile
Don Bosco lived up to 1888. Today he has a following of 35,692 dedicated men and women in over 118 countries. His services reaches out to millions through 7,325 schools and 9,416 centers. Don Bosco's vision is a reality which carries on as an educative force in the present world.